welcome back to Redbeard RPG and Chained Echo. In the last episode, we found out we don't get a choice. We have to go to the city of Basil to get some uh, forged. Well, they're not really forged, but we got to meet with a corrupt official in order to get some documents. Oh, dang it. These one of these things again. In order to get some documents. To let us pass the blockade. Summoning seedling. Good for now. I did notice it seemed like they couldn't die as long as the seedlings were on. Here's that counter. That's a oh automatic win, haha. -ha. Super cool. Um, she gonna have to have a snack. Uh, as are you. Ah, oh, dang it! Not might as well at this point. Heal her so I can keep doing fire thrusts. Dang, man! That's so cheap. Screw it. Yeah, of course you're summoning. Uh, you I can swap out and sort of that. Okay, so it literally doesn't hurt people if they're already at 1 HP. That's good to know. Should be able to finish her off this round. Okay. Good grief. Alright. Well. Now do... I check stats. I assume everyone comes back to life after every fight. I think is how it works. I think everybody gets fully healed. Well, there's a way to get over there, so let's figure that out. Dang it. Gotta get to the map on the other side. That's kind of what I'm thinking. Go around this way. And can I come down somewhere? Let me get that treasure. I like this treasure. Enemies. Eh, let's, let's see what they're all about. Okay, they look like water things. Crabs, probably wind. Nice. Elemental rod. That will hit particularly hard. Seems like they got pretty good defense though. bubbles. Dang, still not down. Let's 
get X slash. I feel like I'm not paying enough attention to that pedal storm. It is active now. I feel like I've definitely missed quite a few of those opportunities to do huge damage. Got a snack back, excellent. After those stupid little plant monsters. How in the heck did that treasure? Let me in. Oh, thought I went back and checked. There, across the bridge we go. Keep looking for potential ways. Over that treasure. Hopefully there's some treasure here, nice. Debuff overdrive. Crabs. Treasures, it seems. The long path down. Somewhat hidden ish. Make me think, yeah, we can go behind the waterfalls. Up and over to the treasure. Some sweets, that's a little disappointing. This. Oh, you can just jump down. Well, that doesn't really save me any time or effort because we still got to go back around to the next area. I believe, unless this was the edge of the map in the city of Basil. Not in this direction, I assume it is. No, no, no. Check that map. Star there. I am just kind of aimlessly wandering around this. Stay away from. I want that crystal. Back this way. Perfect. I don't like fighting those. Got a treasure indicator. Another. There's the other indicator pointing this way. Treasure's got to be. That one pointing. Kind of the only place they intersect is down around here. Down another tier, but in that general vicinity. If I get to that cave. a lot of loot if nothing else we are achieving that how valuable any of this stuff is it's kind of hard to say oh, there's literally a door right there can't go in there can't go there all right a little bit of a dead end maybe we have to activate something that door will open up i i have a hard time believing they put a door a singular door in the side of the mountain just for aesthetics and that that area serves literally no purpose other than decor Dang, all the 
was fine wool. I want dirty wool. Literally sounds like it would be better. Not what I need for what I'm doing. For that special deal. I really, I really do hope that deal it doesn't make you go all the way back to farm sport. Maybe the game naturally takes you back there at some point and you collect that then. I think we found the city of Basil. Mansion up there belongs to Becker. Rich guy from farm sport, new home to escape the city from time to time. Arrogant prick though, and nobody likes him. Great, Nana. Hey, kitty. Looks like one of those special beasts that were uh, in the middle of the first area last time. Oh, this is the mansion. Let's not quite go here yet. Let's do a little city exploration. Treasure up there. Get around this house this way I can. Good grief. This place is real extravagant for the mayor of a small town. Seems a little much. Like perhaps he might be skimming a little off the top of the town's taxes. Five arc and I'll tell you a secret. Sure, why not kid? Awesome. To the east is the city of Farnsport. Follow the coast line from there, you'll reach Tamuria, the caves, just before that is a little tree full of water. You can swim into the tree from behind and reach the cave. I don't know what's in there, though. Why don't you check it? Perhaps I will. Built of farmers, they have fields. Transport a huge quantity. Got a little blacksmith, item salesman. I hate, I hate this life, like for real. It's only worth the living life as a farmer. Being a farmer's wife, seriously, look at my mom. Not only do they have to help their husbands in the fields, but they also have to get working at home, always cleaning up as husbands as if. It will definitely not happen to me. I'm totally moving to farm sport, whatever. At the kitty. Uh, 30 bucks. Let's see. Same turn. Down. Wish I'd made. Oh boy. Well, that's where she gets it from. Probably has some kind of inclination that you're very disappointed with your life choices. Therefore, has no intention on giving this lifestyle a chance. How that works? Oh, cutscene? There you are, saviors at last. Thanks a lot for helping me against the... Oh, Beast of the Mills, that's right. Okay, uh, yeah. Please take this small thank you. Humphy Scarf. Uh... Anything happened lately? Moment, defensive fart, sports at everyone's lips. Probably heard the number of monsters increasing Increasing dramatically. Last few weeks, appearance of being killed animals. Everyone's afraid. Goblin problem as well. Surface to steal from us. Interesting. Right, she has a lot to tell you. But essentially, yeah, there's beasts and goblins and... Aw, oh, dog, you're supposed to be nice. Big kitty monster. Oof, that thing's a little intimidating. Got the barkeep, pass clothes. Lots of chit-chat in the background. That's where I keep my attack ups, is in my uh, potted plants around the house. Treasure, oil lamp, nice. 
and another attack up. Ooh. That is, I, I mean, it's realistic, but it is weird how every once in a while the animal doesn't like being pet. Hey. They're talking about this like this is a small, quaint village. The got quite a few amenities from what I can tell. Even its own library cave? The silver breastplate? Somebody live here? What is this? Is it a dungeon? It's got a library, but then it's got a bed behind bars as well. Best equipment, fraction of the price. Ah, we got weapons. Iron sword. Lattice. Helps the pack. Okay, it has a little... Some little indicator as to who actually used the weapon. Lave is an improvement. I think I have some of these weapons I found along the way though. But yeah, they have some sort of upgrade for everyone. I'll actually have to go through go through. We'll do we'll do that another time. We don't need to necessarily do that right now. We'll just we just need to remember this place is here and we'll come back to it. We've done plenty of wandering around and inventory managing and things of the like. Another treasure chest. Let's Now I want to see, is there really anything else this city has to offer? That's kind of the big question. Can back here without taking the extra time of actually going to the house. Build. Alright, I think that's going to be the last treasure chest here in town. I'm hiding down here. Yeah, I think that's whole town explored. Perfect. All right, let's go meet up with the mayor. See what the cost of greasing his palms is, as I'm assuming how that's going to go. Whoop, wrong way. In order to get our special pass and move along with our adventure. a pretty big house. I bet there's something good there. Before we head off and start what I assume is going to be a cut scene. Dang, he ain't got nothing. Did he? Let's have a kitty. There's lots of maids as well. It's kind of overkill. Talking trash about the owner, Sir Becker. And backtracked when she realized someone was listening. Ah, damn it, that's too tight. Sorry? My fiance will return any moment, make haste. Sir. Excuse me. It's 200 arc per permit. I have four left for a total of 800. What? You're here for passes, right? You're not the first today. Since the borders close, you can only cross with a special permit. I'm the only one issuing them, at least the only one who doesn't ask unpleasant questions. And we can certainly cross the border with thee. Who do you think I am? I'm not doing any illegal business. Those are officially issued permits. Every civil servant has the right to issue them at their own discretion. What the hell? Becker, where the hell are you? I'm waiting. I'll be there in a second, my sweet honeybee. How long do you need? Ugh. I've, I've been trying to fix these trousers for hours. Sorry, almost done. You guys still here? Sorry. 
Were we doing a rehearsal for a wedding today? Not the best timing. His permits are on the table. Put the money there and I'll take, take them. Four passes are not enough. Sorry, that's all I have left. We'll take them for the time being. At worst, only four of us will be able to cross the border. Let me cover the cost this time. I got some travel money left. Take a map at the table there. If you want to, I th think of it as a little perk that comes with the permits. I've marked a safe route through the mountains for you. Please leave now. Let's put those permits to use and head for the border. Isn't it strange? What do you mean? As I understand it, he's been selling regular passes for quite some time now. With the border closed, the need for a special permit, he could charge extra. And he sells them for only 200 arc. Why would he do that? Wondering that myself. Don't look a gift horse in the mouse. Mouth, if we can cross the border with these, then everything's fine. Let's go then. Alright, I'm getting the sense that we're probably not going to be able to cross the border with them. Right, let's do a little inventory management. Back to this. Iron sword. I don't have an upgraded weapon for him. Doublet. Everything better but defense. Campbellson straight downgrade. Silver breastplate seems to be a straight upgrade. Okay. Does have the glaive. Upgrade her. Raven cloak sacrifices defense and HP for TP and mind, which for her is probably better. Gambesons seem to not be very good at all. Raven cloaks the her. I forgot about accessories. Comfy scarf does nothing. Okay. Maybe it'll do something for somebody. Great sword is all he's got. Good as it's gonna get him. Oh no, wait, the sturdy act to slightly better. Him that. Whoops. Not what I wanted. Got the sword upgrade and plain t shirt can be replaced with doublet. As she can only wear light armors, I guess. We'll give her the comfy scarf. Doesn't seem to do anything. Amazon hurts HP and T helps defense and mind. I don't think that is worth it. Doesn't help it much. Better off trying to see if they got a doublet for sale. Raven Cloak is just a great upgrade from the robe. Cloak. Alright. Alright, now we got our best stuff equipped. Let's see. How much money do we get? We only got 400 bucks. Now we might not be able to buy Jack. All the good stuff is 500. Whoops. Yep, can't afford it. Okay, never mind then. Well, this uh, this little section of inventory management is going to go quick. Uh, I want to get a doublet. What if we what if we sell? Got spears. Nobody used. Engine. 
common katana. And every other weapon's being used. Gamison, we might. They don't need the iron cure. It's done with those. Here we get rid of strobe. This stuff we don't care about. I think so. This stuff we might need for heal stuff. So that's crafting. That'll do. 400 bucks. Woo. -y. That raises the question what do we want to? Probably the doublet, right? I think uh, I think our bowman was the only one who didn't have an armor up. Get us one of those. And we're broke. I'll sell that doublet real quick. Or plain shirt, I'm sorry. Get our 50 bucks out of it. I sincerely hope you're not trying to talk to him at it. Well, the game gave me the option. Alright, so we need to head back the road. Now, let's check that map real quick. I think this area in the south and the area east we have not discovered much of yet. Might as well look around while we're here, right? Knows there might be some good treasure about. Got a fast travel point if we run into an issue. That looked like that took us to the at the south. There he is gonna be painted like all broken up. Now we're technically. Oh dang! What have I done? What have I done? Oh, can't climb back up. I guess we're going this way. That's all blocked off. All right, so I think we will actually get to the area I was trying to go to in the first place by complete accident. There we go, we got an achievement for exploring most of the areas. A lot of this seems blocked off at the moment. Oh, I didn't even see them. Well, there's five of these big gears, so we're gonna be here for a minute. Pedal Storm's active, so that's good. They were weak fire, correct? You guys up front. And one down. Got a better pedal storm, but it doesn't really seem very necessary. Perfect. Got quite a few resources out of them. Got another fast travel point. Excellent, excellent. I'd like to pray to the heroes of Lenore. Let's offer a sacred water pray. We don't possess any sacred water. All right, but now we know this is here. 
looks like that's all I can do. It looks like I can't get over to that area at this particular time. The path will open up to us eventually. Alrighty. So, we will get heading back. And we will... Um, get to the bridge crossing and progress the journey next time. Thank you guys so very much for watching and have a good one.